it's great to have you here. It's good to see you again. <laughs> and uh, the, uh, I apologize for having rescheduled yesterday. I had a lot of fun yesterday afternoon. We, uh, I had a uh, little toothache problem I took care of. And uh, thank you for accommodating me. And the support that uh, we are providing together to Ukraine is now making a difference uh, on the battlefield as we speak. Because the offensive is launched and the Ukrainians are making progress, uh, uh, making advances. Uh, it's still early days, uh, but what we do know is that the more land Ukrainians are able to liberate, um, uh, the, 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 the stronger hand they will have at the negotiating table. We also, uh, we've strengthened NATO's eastern flank, made it clear that we'll defend every inch of NATO territory. And I say it again, the commitment of the United States to NATO, Article 5, is rock solid. And our summit in Lithuania next month, we're going to be building on that momentum from working to ensure that allies spend enough on the defense, the 2 percent, not just uh, as a, a height, but that's the bottom line. Uh, and that's exactly what we'll do when we meet uh, all the NATO leaders at the summit in Vilnius uh, next month, where we'll agree to sustain and step up our support to Ukraine, further strengthen our uh, deterrence and defense, including by a new commitment uh, to invest more in defense. And I expect allies to agree that 2% of GDP for defense uh, uh, has to be a minimum of what allies have to invest uh, in our shared security. And, uh, uh, Putin was making a mistake. He was looking for the findalization of NATO. He got the NATOization of Finland and hopefully Sweden very shortly. And uh, the, uh, uh, your friendship and leadership has meant a great deal. Um, uh, President Putin must not win this war because uh, um, that will not only be a tragedy for the Ukrainians but also make the world more dangerous. It will be, send a message to authoritarian leaders all over the world, also in China, that when they use military force, they get what they want. Uh, and we will then become more vulnerable. So it's our security interest to support uh, Ukraine. And um, I think it's a, a real clear message. So God willing, we're going to be able to keep this unity up. And uh, thank you for your leadership. President, have you discussed? Thank you. Mr. President, thank you very much, have you read the Trump everyone, indictment, thank you very sir? Much. Everyone, thank you very much. Do you agree with everyone, Dr. Biden? Thank you very much, everyone. That she was surprised Republicans. Very much, everyone. We're going to begin exiting this way.